We're going on an epic four day trip around the Cabot Trail. Let's go. So we picked up this car yesterday from a lovely old lady. Hello, her name is Pearl. She's from Budget, what was it? Budget Cars in North Sydney. <laughs> Pearl! Not sponsored. Shout out to Pearl. If you're not familiar with the Cabot Trail, it is located in Canada, in Nova Scotia, on Cape Breton Island. And it is a 298 kilometer roadway that is known as one of the best road trip destinations in the entire world. The best. The best. <laughs> So if you're going counterclockwise around the trail, the first stop you have to do is the English Town Ferry. And it's you can take St. Anne's as well. Yeah. We're just taking the ferry because we've never taken it before. Wow. Also, if you were wondering how much it was, it's $7. Skyler's pain. <laughs> Turns out it's free! <laughs> no charge during COVID-19. So if you want a little unique experience, come here. But I actually don't travel anywhere right now because it's not safe, right? JK, hit up the trail. <laughs> come to the ferry. <laughs> wow, Wendy, isn't this wow? So we're doing a quick little stop at the Red Island Trail because Indy is very, very warm. Very warm. And so are we. Yeah, so if you're traveling with a dog this summer, at least there's lots of places to stop and let them cool down. Um, that's really important we have to keep in mind for her. Is it salty? <laughs> <laughs> So we found this neat little spot, but we won't be staying long because the bugs are crazy. She's like, this is great. <laughs> She's so happy. This is really nice. The bugs are really bad, but it's really nice. She, we've never seen her swimming this month. We left Andy in the water because the bugs are so bad. She's like, that was great, Mom and Dad. Oh my gosh, that was the best ever. Possibly be the best place in the world. <laughs> chocolate shop. It has chocolate in its name, so David's coming out. All right, what do we got? Okay, so we just stopped at Cabado Chocolates. It's also a gallery that is Coloratura Gallery. Um, lots of Chris. Pinsky uh, products in there, amazing. And we got two different things. So first of all, actually, right before you go in the door, there's hand sanitizer. There is a warning notice as well, just to stay six feet apart and all of those health advi advisories. And then when you're walking through, there's some arrows and yeah, felt super safe the whole time. We got two different things. Moose Munch, which is Cocoa, sugar, obviously. Uh, vanilla, <laughs> what, what, what did she say was in it? I thought it was peanut butter. Peanut butter. It's chocolate peanut butter. Oh, it's basically chocolate peanut butter. I think there might be some nuts in there and uh, pretzels. Yeah. Moose munch. Hopefully we see some moose as well. And Canadian crunch, which is white chocolate ginger crisp. So it's white chocolate in the shape of cute little... Um, maple leaves and has crunched up ginger snaps in it. Cool. Pretty excited. Oh, that is really good. Yeah. Oh my god, the ginger is so yummy. That is also really good. We're just gonna have to eat them all because you're gonna melt. Yeah. Otherwise. I'm gonna eat all these ones. Though. Man, these are good. And next up is... Glass Artisans. Let's go. It's Glass Artisans, I think. How do you say that word? No, she said, at the chocolate shop, she said Artisans. Okay. Yeah. I guess so. That was a really lovely stop. It's 
it's so pretty in there. We were just talking to Wendy Smith, the owner of the Glass Artisan Studio and Gallery, and she gave us uh, one of these maps. So if you're going around the Cow Trail, make sure you pick up one of these. It is an artisan, artisan trail map. <laughs> <laughs> and it features all of the different businesses. How awesome. Also, in this gallery, there are over like 40 different artists in there. All of the work is so unique and so lovely. I'm a big hand talker, so I had to make sure I was talking very small because <laughs> I was scared I was gonna bump something. <laughs> Worth the stop. Look at the view. Me. Me. It's gorgeous. Checking in. Checking in. All right, we just picked up our key from Naughty Pie. The super nice people there. Oh my gosh, they were lovely. Oh, it's so nice. Wow. This is gorgeous. Oh, this is lovely. Super private. I love how private it is. Like the higher, you can be sitting here and not be bothered by anybody. This is beautiful. What's up? How do you like it? Isn't this your favorite place ever? I love the coastal. Let's go get a beer and then get some food. Best burgers in the world. I got the ringer. So it is a mozzarella cheeseburger with a onion rings and bacon. And sweet potato fries with I'm guessing chipotle mayo. I got the same thing, but without the onion rings and an extra patty. Whoever floats your boat, man, are you gonna be able to eat it all? Yeah, I'm not sure how I'm gonna get back out of here without getting my feet wet. Oh, you, you remember you gotta get in too, right? <laughs> <laughs> nice. Awesome, man. Thanks, I'm only swimming. <laughs> <laughs> okay, welcome to the Naughty Pine. Look, you get, look is this such a good view of them? This is the best. Okay, wait. We gotta go back. You, no, you gotta go this way. Go, go. Watch this rock. Say hi, mom. Hi, mom. Hi, mom. <laughs> we just took a, a paddle boat that we don't know if it works. We threw our dog in it. All of our expensive camera gear. Now we're paddling out to sea. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> Indy's loving it, actually.
Yeah, it's definitely morning. We're here on top of Franny. It's about five. Oh, oh, there. Oh, who's that? There we oh, go. No. And Sean and the ever quiet. David. <laughs> Happy birthday, David. Thank you. We are on top of Franny for a sunrise. Us and a few other thousand mosquitoes. Oh, I came across a snake at Warren Lake yesterday. One more, if you don't mind. So we just hiked for any trail for sunrise with Adam Hill and Sean McMillan. It was a six and a half kilometer hike. Not too bad. How long did it take us? Uh, it took us, well, we were up there like, three hours total, but it took us 45 minutes to get up there and probably, I don't know, 20 minutes to get down. Yeah. So, <laughs> it's um, a really great spot for sunrise, that's yeah. for sure. This time of year, though, the sunrise is so early. <laughs> so now we're gonna check out um, Bean Barn and see if it's open. Hopefully. We are starving. We're starving, and we would love some more coffee. Let's go. What's in there? I shouldn't have even asked for milk. We have a four liter jug in our cup. Oh, it's milk. Why did they give you so many? What are your thoughts on White Point? I love it. It's so nice here. Oh shit, I forgot there's two of them? Yeah, I don't remember there being two. She was like, oh yes, thank you, I'm so thirsty. But then she took like two sips and then she was worried that you were going to leave her. We forgot her pop-out little container. What's your tips for White Point? I don't know. It's really nice. We've been here on a windy winter's day, and then we've seen people come here on other windy days. So we're pretty lucky that we're just here on a slightly breezy day. But it would be a great spot for a photo shoot. I see a lot of people come here for photo shoots. Or just a picnic. It's really or nice to just come. And it's not even a long walk. You yeah. just come sit down here and enjoy it. And the water's super clear. And you can just watch the fishing boats around. So where are we going next? Next, I believe, we are going to meet Cove. The hike mountain. More mountains. done this hike before and it's not in the clouds it's not in the clouds this is the first time we've ever been here to do this hike this is our fifth time here trying to do it yeah maybe I think so maybe. we've come here so many times yeah. and it's never been clear Wow Wow Pretty steep. Mm -hmm. 
So we made it. And Adam cheated and just flew up here. Look at this guy. You can he's see probably, his car down there. He's probably like, just look at the view of the <laughs> That's his car down there. We finally did it. High five, bud. Nice. High five, girlfriend. That's good. <laughs> <laughs> David always calls me bud. <laughs> High five. High five. Yeah. Oh, girl. Okay. Maybe 20 minutes later and it's, we're in the clouds. Just flew in this crazy weather with the drone. Oh, hi Andy. It's pretty awesome. Now we're heading to our, our hostel for the night and gonna go find some dinner. I'd also like to check out the beach. The beach? The beach! Okay. Thanks. Let's go to the beach. Let's go to the beach. And we're here at the Markland for dinner. And the weather got really, really gross. And cold, yeah. It's really pretty though, like the dramaticness of the sky with the mountains. Yeah, maybe I should fly the drone. Maybe you should fly the drone. Cute drone sequence. So we just ordered, um, you can't dine in right now. Skylar's just taking a photo of their hours. Okay, so these are potato cheese bites with sour cream. Uh, this is, looks like the burrito bowl. So I got a burrito and no hot sauce and salad and that's coleslaw. Wow. And a pulled pork burger. Oh my gosh, I didn't know the fries were these. Yeah, those look really nice. Just arrived at Highland Hostel. We're super sleepy. <laughs> we just ate too, so <laughs> we're like gonna like roll in. It's the best place ever. But do we have the energy for it? Of course. <laughs> So we have a private room for tonight at the Highland Hostel. Bryson and Patricia are the owners here and they are the best people you'll ever meet. This is new actually, isn't it? This window? Cool. Yeah, it is. It's awesome. Oh. <laughs> yes. Oh, heat pump. Cool. Okay. I'm so tired. I'm so tired too. I was like trying to do those videos. I was falling asleep. Like my mouth. Oh, hello there. Indy does Highland Hostel Bell Tower. Oh. And go. <laughs> Good girl. <laughs> Man, those are nice windows. Oh my gosh, I'm scared. I don't know why I'm scared. It's no more sketchier than the one that we have at home. Did I screw it up? Yeah. David's for scale? No, yeah, it's the same. No, it's not. <laughs> Mine for scale. Pretty good. <laughs> Cheers for my bell tower. What are we just about to do right now? We are about to drive from Cape North 
to Bay St. Lawrence and pick up a couch. Maybe. We gotta go scout it out first. We don't know if the couch is there. <laughs> and what are we doing with the couch? We might be setting it on fire. <laughs> <laughs> with a fiddler. <laughs> So we just checked out of the Highlands Hostel. We had such an awesome night. Thank you to Bryson and Patric Patricia and Billy Rose and Cash and Peter. Uh, we really enjoyed ourselves and now we are headed to meet up with friends at Beulah Grand Falls. Well, it's not really friends, it's the other team. So if you ever come to the Gabba Trail, you have to stay at Highland Hostel. You have to stay at Highland Hostel. <laughs> I think it's gonna be a rainy day today, so Indy's got her rain jacket on. Good. Very nice, Indy. How do you like it? Oh, I guess, bra. This is Bulik Van, and it's less than a minute walk. It's right there. Happy birthday to you! Pretend to laugh. Happy in the woods. <laughs> it, it is. It is fairly. Yeah, <laughs> 